Remember the first time you tried a VR headset? The wires, the weight, the disappointment? Well, Samsung is getting ready to change all that. They have been secretly working on an innovative codename Project Mohan, a device that promises to finally make mixed reality a seamless part of our lives. But there's more to this story than just advanced tech. Today, let's discuss about Project Mohan, Samsung's strategy behind it, its competition with Apple Vision Pro, price, release date, and more. Before we start, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you don't miss my new video. So what is this Project Mohan? Project Mohan is the codename of Samsung's sudden entry into the world of premium XR headsets. Samsung has teamed up with two powerhouses, Google, who are providing the foundational software with their brand new Android XR operating system, and Qualcomm, whose Snapdragon XR2 Plus Gen 2 chip will be the brains powering this immersive experience. Leaks and industry insights suggest high-resolution micro OLED displays will be at the heart of the visuals. And interestingly, the design seems to favor an external detachable battery pack, a potential move to keep the headset itself lightweight. The core focus, as expected, is on delivering seamless mixed reality experiences, blending the digital and physical worlds. So why now? Why Samsung is stepping into this developing high-end XR market? It's likely a comprehensive strategy. Firstly, the obvious competition. Apple Vision Pro has generated significant buzz and Samsung as a leading tech innovator wouldn't want to be left behind in what many believe is the next major computing platform. But it's more than just rivalry. Samsung boasts a vast ecosystem of devices, smartphones, tablets, smartwatches, and XR could be the next frontier for integrating these experiences. Does this suggest a more experimental approach, a way to measure consumer interest and refine the technology before a fully-fledged long-term commitment? If you look at the biggest competitor, the Apple Vision Pro, Samsung is clearly aiming for a similar high-end market segment. Where could they potentially gain an edge? Price is a major factor. The rumored $999 price point for Project Mohan, if accurate, would significantly undercut the Vision Pro. The deep integration with Android XR and Google's Gemini AI could also appeal to a different user base already invested in the Android ecosystem. However, Apple has a strong brand loyalty and well-established ecosystem. Samsung needs to offer a compelling and differentiated experience to fluctuate consumers. Perhaps a more open platform or focus on specific use cases beyond media consumption or maximizing the display manufacturing skill in unique ways. Reports indicate Samsung might be looking to both Sony and their own Samsung display for these panels likely to diversify their supply chain and ensure production capabilities. This collaboration, if true, highlights the complexity and interconnectedness of the tech industry even among competitors in other areas. There is also rumored limited production run of only 1 lakh units for the initial launch of Project Mohan. This relatively small number has significant implications. It strongly suggests that Samsung might be initially targeting developers and early adopters to build out the Android XR ecosystem and gather feedback. It could also indicate caution regarding the market's demand of high-end XR or potential limitations in the supply of key components like those advanced micro OLED displays linked to the previously mentioned collaboration. A limited release could create exclusivity and generate hype, but it also means wider consumer availability will likely be delayed. Now, what could be Project Mohan's name? Mohan means infinity in Korean, is a fitting code name. But what will the final product be called? Samsung has various branding strategies. They could stick with a simple, impactful name that emphasizes the XR aspect. Perhaps something in the Galaxy family like Galaxy XR or Galaxy Immersive. They might also opt for a name that highlights the key features of the collaboration, though that's less likely for a consumer-facing product name. Considering the infinity meaning, maybe something like Samsung Infinity Vision? Let me know your name prediction in the comments below. While Samsung has officially confirmed a release date in late 2025, maybe October 2025, the exact timing remains a mystery. Looking at typical tech release cycles and potential competitor moves, we might see it launch around the holiday season to capitalize consumer spending. Major tech events in the later half of the year could also serve as potential launch platforms. However, the limited production numbers might release, perhaps starting in key markets like South Korea before expanding globally. The rumored price of $999 is a crucial strategic decision. It positions Project Mohan significantly lower than Apple Vision Pro, making it potentially more accessible to a broader audience of tech enthusiasts and early adopters. 
However, it still sits in the premium category above the current high-end offerings from Meta. Samsung needs to ensure that the features and experiences justify the price point and offer a compelling alternative to both ends of spectrum. So what's the bottom line with Project Moan? It's a strong contender with the high-end XR race. However, Samsung needs to deliver a compelling user experience and build a robust ecosystem to truly succeed. What are your thoughts on Project Mohan? Are you excited about Samsung entering the XR arena? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video, share it with anyone interested in future of tech and subscribe to my channel for more in-depth explorations of latest innovations. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.